For cheap NBA 2K21 MT, make sure y'all boys hit up NBA 2K King and use code JR for 5% off at checkout. If you guys need your badges maxed out fast and legit, hit up Star Grinders on Twitter or Instagram and tell them JR sent you. Their links will be in the description down below. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy JR. Y'all boys know I'm back with another banger. And in this video, I have a glitch a lot of you guys have been asking for. This right here is going to be the best badge glitch if you have a player that's already in my career. So yeah man, um, make sure y'all boys watch the video and make sure you guys follow the, direct the directions. This glitch is super easy and super simple and it is a fast way to get some extra badges as well. Make sure y'all boys drop a like, drop a sub. Also shout out to it's your boy Sam for letting me use his clips in this video. So yeah man, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get right into the video so step number one is all you guys want to do is just start a regular my career game and in this game the settings you guys can have it on like i would probably do 12 minute quarters and then you guys can put the settings on pro difficulty which will make it easier for you guys to get your badges um this year it doesn't matter you know which difficulty you have it on um it doesn't give you any extra badge progress so pro is always a way to go if you guys are trying to get your badges now like i said in this game you guys are gonna ball out and get as much badge progress as you possibly can so that's why i said put the quarter length on 12 minutes and then what you guys want to do is just play the game all the way through until the fourth quarter also if you're doing this on like a brand new player a lot of you guys may not get a lot of minutes in the fourth quarter because you guys know how it is whenever you, whenever you first make a player you guys may not play a lot in the fourth quarter so one way that you guys can get around that is get five fouls in the first half so that will allow you to play in the fourth quarter which you guys need to get under a like under a minute left in the fourth quarter and save and quit so i would do that if you're doing it on a new player just to make sure you guys don't get subbed out All right, so look, once you guys get to the fourth quarter with under like 30 seconds left or so, it doesn't really matter. Just make sure there's under a minute left. All you guys want to do is um, save and quit out of the my career game. So set number one, save and quit. And then once you guys save and quit, you guys will be loaded back into the NBA 2K21 main menu. Now, once you get back to the NBA 2K21 main menu, all you guys want to do is just close out the application. And then you guys want to go to the settings tab on your PS4. 
Now once you get to the settings tab, you guys want to go to application, save data management. You guys can use a USB or PS Plus to do this, it doesn't really matter. Then you guys want to go to save data and system storage. And from here you guys can select USB or online storage if you have PS Plus. You guys can use either, it doesn't really matter. And then you guys want to select on NBA 2K21. And then you guys want to select on that very first micro file that you see. And then you guys want to go ahead and hit upload. Now after you guys hit upload, all you guys want to do is just reload NBA 2K21 and back up. And then you guys want to re-upload the mock career player that you're currently doing the glitch on. Now once you reload him back up, all you guys want to do is go ahead and let the game finish out. All right, so once you reload back in, you guys can shoot, up, shoot another shot or wherever the case may be, but for the most part, you guys will just want to let the game run out. And like I was saying, if you guys are doing this on a brand new player, a lot of times you won't be subbed in the fourth quarter. So a workaround for that is just um, get five fouls, and more than likely, whenever you do that, you'll play. You'll actually play to the end of the fourth quarter, just so you still get your minutes. That that is the best workaround for that. If you're having trouble, you know, staying in in the fourth quarter. But uh, like I said, all you guys want to do is once you reload the game back up, go ahead and let the Tom run out. Now, once the time runs out, you guys, of course, will see you'll get your mod points and your badge progress for this game. Now, the key with this glitch is after you guys see your VC load up, all you guys want to do is close out the application. Now, what you guys want to do is come back 24 hours later and reload this file. And I'll show you guys how to do that in one moment. Just make sure you guys wait 24 hours later. So, once you come back 24 hours later, just go to settings, go to application, save data management. And then select on the save data and online storage if that's what you got if that's what you use or you guys can use you know your usb wherever the case may be and then select on nba 2k21 And then what you guys want to do is just select on that micro file that you see right there and hit download. And once you do that, reload the game back up, let it finish out and repeat every 24 hours to keep getting the same batch progress over and over.